I'm explaining to you what we have to do. So when, I'm gonna take a deep breath because you know I'm hyper. Yes, I know. Hyper means that I have a lot of energy and I'm very tense and I need to meditate. So stay calm. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna stay, I'm gonna calm. stay calm. So the first thing I wanna do is I wanna go visit the people and I wanna ask them a little bit about the different kinds of persimmons. I wanna just show people the incredibly beautiful ones. Should I steal one? Hey, don't be judging. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, it's a juicy one. This is this is not a garlic. oak. Go ahead, try it. Is it, it. soft? Mm. Oh my gosh. Mm. 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 Wow. Mm. I'm so happy like, to be here. It's like eating candy off a tree. So this is Diospyros cocky. And that is the persimmon. It originated in China, perhaps in Korea, and also Japan, but it made its way across Central Asia to the point that for the last few hundred years at least, it's been being cultivated in the Caucasus and also in Iran because it's a subtropical fruit. So strangely enough, even though Armenia has areas that are extremely frigid, in this part of uh, Armenia, right near the Iranian border, it's actually very, very temperate, which means the temperatures don't get too uh, frigid in the winter. Hence these type of fruits which grow in zones seven and eight in the United States do very well. So we're gonna go up and try to see how people are processing these because we've already been in a few factories and saw how they did it. This uh, is much different than the fruit we saw last night in the factory because what they're really doing, uh, these are wet ones. So these wouldn't dry well, but yet it is a special one for eating fresh. But we'll go up there and see how they do it. Mm. It's like eating candy. Shown us the dried persimmons. As we were as we were coming up, uh, Mr. Morat he, yeah. he asked us to come up and see all his drying persimmons. Now they have quite a procedure how they do these. First of all, they have to take the fresh persimmons, which here in this Sunak region of southeast Armenia we have two different types. Yeah, now, uh, karalok and hurma. Hurma and karalok. Uh, it's uh, hurma, karalevsky, and karalok. What she said. Uh, That's he said. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm now he's what, what we have right here, um, we have two different types of persimmons. Scientific name is Diospyros kaki, and what we have right here is an amazing process. They peel them off, and they do a they do a really uh, complicated procedure and hang them on fish string. It looks like it's a nylon fish string type thing, and they put these little hooks in them. They put little hooks in them, and they hang these for how long did he say to hang them? One month. One month. One month. And the final product well, final is a product. super delicious dried fruit that we say it tastes it tastes so delectable and you like, can't imagine. It's like a um, it tastes almost, like chocolate almost. Mm, well, you say chocolate. I say like a sweet date mixed persimmon, maybe chocolatey, yeah, maybe something. a touch of chocolate. Persimmons are not just a thing in Armenia; they're a way of life. Persimmons are a way of life, but if you take a whole shot right here, I don't know if you guys can see this. We're going to stand up and walk through Let's go. down the tunnel. Let's go. We're walking down the persimmon wow. tunnel, and this is very few people get to do this, especially seeing uh, very few people have been to this part of the world where it's so important to have all this. We want to bring this to the whole world and show them what this life is all about. Well, I like this I'm, process. I'm coming through here. I'm, okay, you go through there. I feel like I am <laughs> in paradise, you know? Tell, <laughs> tell him that we love his house and we love him. Нам нравится ваш дом, и вы нам нравитесь тоже. We love you. Мы вас любим, вот он говорит. Very good man. Вы нам очень помогли. Да. Спасибо. 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 Wow. Just imagine if you had persimmon phobia. If you had persimmon phobia here, this could really surprise a lot of people. <laughs> Too many persimmons! <laughs> no, he's a lovely person. Thank you very much. Thank you for showing us. And uh, we're gonna take. Can we buy some of these? Can we help? Can we help you out and buy some? No. Yes. Yes. Okay. I would like to buy some from them for, but well, maybe the fresh ones. 
Fresh ones. I want to help him with something. Mm -hmm. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs>